Hey everyone, it's Dr. Jess. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to discuss how to calculate day supply for liquid dosage forms. Please don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any new uploaded videos. Okay, let's get started. Before we go into how to calculate the day supply for liquid dosage forms, there are some common conversion equivalents that I think um, is um, are important for you to know. So if you're looking at a prescription or if you're given a problem, sometimes the unit for the liquid will be given in something else other than ml. So sometimes it could be um, teaspoon, tablespoon, ounces. Um, there are others, but these are the most common ones. So it is important for you to know how to convert between those units in ml. So the first one, one teaspoon is 5 ml, one tablespoon is 15 ml, and one ounce is 30 ml. Let's look at this prescription together calculate the day supply so we have the following prescription trimethoprim sulfamethoxazole 40-200 mg per 5 ml one teaspoon by mouth twice daily and dispense 100 ml so how do we calculate the day supply so the day supply is the quantity of liquid dispense divided by the amount of liquid um, taken in one day. So here, what is the quantity of liquid being dispensed? So it's 100 ml. What is the amount of liquid taken in one day? So it's one teaspoon twice daily. So one teaspoon is um, how many ml? It's 5 ml. So 5 ml twice daily. So in one day, that means you're taking 5 times 2. It's 10 ml. So then to calculate the day supply, it is 100 ml divided by 10, and the day supply is 10. So it's a 10-day supply. 